Hey everybody, XCI here. Welcome back to a blind let's play of Dragon Age Inquisition. Now we have Somli and Skyhold. I know I have codexes to read. It's a new week. Well, not for you guys. You guys have been watching this, well, more more often. I am trying to get a schedule. It's not really working. I'm trying. I'm trying I'm try as best as I can to get these daily, but it's not, it's not possible. So, <laughs> so I'm trying. But anyways, we have some uh, map stuff to figure out here uh, to push forward. So we have Measure Veil Strength. Inquisitor, the experiment was a, was a success, and these readings are remarkable. By overlaying the relative strength of the veil over maps of Orlay and Ferelden, I have extrapolated points where small rifts are more likely to develop. This should let us deploy Inquisition forces more wisely, while still protecting people who would otherwise be threatened by demons. In addition, I have located one node of possible interest in the Interlands. Hmm? A very large rift that has not yet opened it may be worth investigating the area. Solace. Hmm. I will talk about it. So, I finally finished. I finally finished the Vast Empire. It took me a while. There was a point there. I mean, you guys know how long I've been saying. I, I was like close to the end in the comments. I've been trying to update you. But there was something about it. I, I could, the first half was rough for me. I just think it's just an aversion to Orlay. <laughs> and the fact that the game uh makes me hyper analyze way too much um and so it was it was constantly distracting me from the narrative of the story because i was i'm a de I, I deconstruct narrative that's i love doing it i've been doing it for almost 20 years for 20 years um almost 20 years 2000 uh so it's it's one of these scenarios where if something is very layered it's like i can't really read political novels and stuff like that i can't really read like deep mysteries are, are cool they're cool to fun because the part of the fun of a mystery is that you have to hyper analyze everything because a good mystery writer like uh will see things and you'll never know that they're seeds like that's that's a good mystery uh an adventure story that has a mystery in it is usually decipherable by me um not to say the author's not a good mystery but it, that's not what the that's not what the that's not what the the that's not what the foundation and that's not what the meat of the story is it's an adventure and so a mystery and an adventure it it, it follows certain patterns and I'm, I'm aware of them with orlesian dynamics where everyone could be a player um and i did sort of call it by the end um i don't want to ruin the book for people who haven't read it but i assume if you're watching let's plays you've probably you're committed enough to this franchise to this lore that you've read everything so i'm just gonna warn you now because i might slip into some stuff because there's some important stuff i need to address maybe we'll address it as we play the game but it's relevant to this right now <laughs> that's all it's been. okay so but let's roll this back so with uh with Orlesian politics though halfway through the book where it's the gaspard and the Celine like going at it and you can tell it's all like it's like moving pieces on this on this on the chessboard right um and so every player uh, is 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 a pawn, but you also don't know if they're more than a pawn. As we learn, and this, this with the last spoiler warning, with the Briala, it, uh, her character setup is instantly uh, it, it instantly suggests that she's not even, she's not a she's a pawn but not a pawn uh that's very clearly uh set up with her um that with the relationship with oh my god <laughs> no, don't do this i literally just finished i just powered through the last half of the book today <laughs> like i'm like i'm gonna finish it because i want to play dragon age and i want to go into a map that is relevant to this and to the winter palace and so um uh did it just fell us on fell us on so the relationship with Velasan, that he was her mentor, that that he was strange, he was, and so right away you're like, he's a player, and he's not part of Warlay, he's not part of the game, but instantly you're like, he's a player, he's important, uh, just the way he says things, the way he he composed himself, the way he carried, like yeah, the way he ca carried his teachings, like it was just he was too wise, <laughs> if I could say that. Um, I'm gonna talk too much about this up front. Uh, I don't know if this is wise, but anyway, so, <laughs> so to roll back, the first half of the book where it's all that, it was it was cool, it was decent, the armies and like the shifting and stuff, and then the thing happens in Alam Shiral, and, and you're like, ooh, that was a blow, and it puts Selene against Briala, and it creates a bit of that thing, and then the Briala sets up that thing with uh, Michelle, where she tells him that she'll keep the secret, but he's gonna have to owe her one and right there i'm like oh man another game see what i mean it's just layer after layer of like things have 
everyone owed something like er everything could have been a, a play um right un until the end and so it really got to maybe i don't know 66 percent of the way through the book i would say by about page 250 is when um not even like 220 or something which is where about i started today and then i in and there's like 120 pages after where they they're at the dalish elves and then that you find out the the whole demon thing is part of it. You're like, oh my god, another play because you know the demon is gonna make some play, and the demon's gonna propose something to Michelle, and then you know what I mean, and then and then that's part of the a game, you know, and uh, which is cool, man. But it's just it was a lot of stuff. But it, but okay, so uh, and then the alluvions and the the entire way that that whole thing worked, and I loved, I did love this is when I started loving it. Okay, it's that the it's that I never hated Gaspard, but I all but I almost always hated Celine, and that was a very weird dynamic as I was reading, um, and I hated things Gaspard did, and I liked things that Celine did, <laughs> because she was doing it and she had a greater good her her subjective greater good in mind. But you know what, Gaspard also had a greater good in mind, and so it was the very is it was very gray and is very dragon agey as far. This should be a vlog. <laughs> I should have made this a vlog. I'm gonna wrap this up. And maybe we'll talk about it later. Okay, so and so by the end, where everything starts to fall together, and then the 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 two, you know, Chevalier, like they, that that honor bound kind of notion to them. I love that dynamic so much in the last hundred pages. Uh, and then you got the whole switcheroo thing. The, the whole the whole culmination of every play that was in the game comes to fruition by the end. You're like, oh shit! And then <laughs> the last page with. Mm, the last page where I, there was a point there with where Falasan, uh, nope, that I'm saying the name wrong again. I know it. I'm saying, I'm saying the name wrong again. I know it. No, Falasan. There's a point through the entire uh, Illuvian part of it where, oh my God, some of the descriptions, like some of the Laura pieces in this were really important. They were really important in the last 100, 150 pages of this novel. The way they describe the space in between the real world and the fate and that the fate and the stuff between the alluvion is literally like a manifested war it's it was a it's a demi plane it was a demi plane it's a space between that's crazy good um the the idea of the sleepers the uthanara and those who partook in that and and the, the, some of the dynamic the politics that might have been part of that and um, and then again, Falasan saying stuff that was like, did you live during the Elvenon and the, you know what I mean? Like you're saying stuff like you were there, buddy. So that was like, I'm like, oh my God, maybe this is like something tied to, um, this is something tied to the Dreadwolf to, why do I always forget his name? This is impossible for me. Uh, Fenriel, uh, to Fenriel, like, uh, is this guy tied to Fenriel the same way I believe Solace is tied to Fenriel? And then, uh... Uh, even what, even the words she uses for the Olivian, it was, oh God, this, oh God, it was called, it was translated, it was the Dread Wolf song. I'm never going to find the page. This is like the beginning of the episode. I'm going to look for it. <laughs> look for it. I think I can find it. I, I know it was on the left page. It was on an even numbered page and it was in the top half. Excuse me. Ooh, that was a good story too. The one about Fenriel and... The whole oh, there was some good like parallelism storyline, like stories within stories, like folklore of of when uh, when uh, Fenriel uh, basically goaded the one god to then get an upper hand, but then but then by goading the one god to get the upper hand, it gave the other god the upper hand, to the, to get, and then he kind of they both had to rest off to get to heal themselves, and then he like he chewed 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 uh, chewed his whatever his However, he was bound. He shoot himself freed and, and, and left. Yeah, that was pretty good. Which is kind of relevant to how Briala plays this game. Fen Harel and Ensal, the Dread Wolf's Blessing. Oh, it's when Felassin kisses her on the forehead and she feels like the cold go away. And, uh, okay, so that wasn't the secret word. It was like what she says after she walks away. and she go, They go separate ways. And I thought... Oh, that was interesting considering this guy's talking like he's he's either lived thousands of years or he's got some sort of uh, he's he's talking to whatever the I believe they're spirits. So the spirit of 
Fanriel. I, you know, I'm going to cut around another chunk of stuff. The point being is that by the end, last wording with the spoiler again, <laughs> but literally the last paragraph, last sentence, where it's, where in my head I'm like, this Valacin is is like, is like is like a solace. Like I was I was convinced. I'm like this guy is like a spirit god or something like that. Like he's probably the dread wolf, <laughs> and then he's sitting by the fire and he knows someone's behind him and he's ha and he's like he's just saying that you know just give them a chance like that kind of comment i was like oh shit and then it the, the whole novel ends with him getting i i presume killed um and at that point i was like okay what just so are there there's other spherica oh the demon too said some stuff why i'm derailing again the spirit the demon said <laughs> the demon kept saying like the, the they would say so blah 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 demon is like spirit he kept correcting people to not use the word demon i thought that was key because it goes back to the idea of like well no I, this is I, there's too many details because it's so fresh in my mind i'm ranting and i'm a little like thing of the corner of my screen okay hold on there's a, there's a lot of information in my head right now it's that the when the demon kills the dalish clan uh and gaspar's men get there and they look around they're like one person's flayed alive one person's burned one person's where the throat slit but it's basically none of the deaths are really simple and none of them are the same and i thought i like that comment i was like that's that's a crazy subtle comment that that's super important because then it's like it's not a simple like this isn't a simple sp like a spirits like they ought they have one frame of they they kill things one way because that's you know what i mean like they're very limited in scope but this thing was like brought broadly wanton wantonly slaying and at that point you're like oh this is above a demon this because i'm i'm building i'm like i'm like i'm drafting something and this is like a tier above anything you can think of as being defined as a spirit or a demon which is where i would put where i would put the elven gods for sure i would put as some sort of like super spirits <laughs> super spirit god things or whatever spirits that i or elves that i don't know um I would put the old gods somewhere up there. They're probably old, old spirits, like super, super, uber, over. I don't know. <laughs> I'm trying to work this out. Okay, uh, but but that was important that there was tears there. You know, is that it was called the demon, but it's not. It was probably like an older spirit. You know, like that demon thing. I oh, and it's, it's part. It's important to this why I wanted to play now because I'm like I know where I'm going next. I'm going to go to another map before I go to the Winter Palace. <laughs> <laughs> because because I'm like they gotta continue this story. There's a demon loose out there that Michelle is after. There's Gaspard is who knows what he's up to. Celine she's still trying to you know control, but we're kind we kind of get pieces of that. It's probably Winter Palace because she was left there, you know. So now it's like now it's all clear to me. Um, the Alluvion stuff, the the Elf Bria, Bri, Briala, like I. You know, we've been hearing whispers of people like saying I've been curious about, and now I'm like my regret is that I can't remember. If all the people I heard saying shady shit in the Inquisition, if they were all elves. Because if they were all elves, this is meta. Whoa, that was that was a quarter derail. Okay, so anyways, um, Emerald Graves resources. Oh my god, this is all. I, I delayed a resource grab. And more resource grabs here. Arbor Blessing. Okay, we have everyone back. We can send them Western Approach resources. Let me just take a look here. Oh, 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 deal with the angry Vargas. Yes, the situation. Yes. Um, I wanted to send... Okay, Vargas situation is partly our fault. We took their water, their habitat. Our veteran rangers could try to lead the... Oh, Vargas to a better place where they can establish themselves. Oh, I like that. That option is probably killing them. No? Oh, I'll send some of our rangers... Oh, to hunt and kill these pests. No. No. Let's not do that. Is it shorter? Yeah, but let's not do that. Let's get Liliana to guide them away and send them somewhere else. Okay, uh, what else can we do? All right, we we are as far as I can tell, we are done. Everything's completed. Uh, we have resources that we can grab, and we have the Winter Palace, and we can do a map. So I guess I'll send these. Oh shoot, there was one particular place I wanted to get resources from, right? Like I needed something from some. Oh, the um, the flowers, those flowers. Oh god, where the hell was that again? I needed someone in particular, though. God, I want to just finish that damn quest in the hinterlands. Uh, no. Oh, and I'm heading to the map anyway, so I'll probably find the map and be able to, like, navigate it and stuff. 
So who can get much rare Philanderas can be found there? Well, oh, that's in Prix de Lyon. We should search the Silverite Mines. No, I don't want the medals. Oh. Dang it, nabbit. All right, we can't get the Philanderas right now. Well, she can get some here. Go get Let the herbs. Um, and I still have... Here, let's get... Where was the there are metals? Let's whatever. Let's try the metals with you. Send the metal. Yeah, go get some metals. Okay. Now, now that I've ranted and waste. Oh, there's you know here's the thing. Codexes. I'm probably gonna go to the next. I'm gonna do another map run. Uh, because of this, I want to do this. I want to finish the fire thing. There's a couple things still. I know. I know. I ages ago I said <laughs> I was gonna go to Winter Palace. I was wrong. Arbor blessing, uh, blessed blessed by the vine in spring. I shall not fear the winter sting. Arbor blessing is a useful vine that is notoriously difficult to cultivate, as if it had a mind of its own. The wind often carries the minuscule seeds for great distances from the parent plant. It's hard to say what causes the seeds to sprout once they land. However, it has been it has long been believed that comfort and abundance follow where arbor blessing goes perhaps the vine only chooses conditions that promote rich harvest from domesticated flora therefore see arbor blessing in spring and you shall not grow hungry in winter okay we have history we did unlock something from the mosaics which i'm very curious about too i forget what the name of it was but i will know once i see it because i uh it was the arch team oh is this one <laughs> The Mason's Tales, the Archdemon. I gather this one is titled the Archdemon, not the three Archdemons. And I'll get back to that. Good construction here. A nice balanced carving if you consider Tim Ventures to have equal weight to the dragon's arse. Not a bad comparison, you ask me. Seven magisters and some easy symmetry to give a host something to sound smart about after dinner. If I had to guess, they'd go on about how four lions and four magisters are part of the dragon and favored two lions are piercing it so that no more damage than good and one that big one farthest out i gotta see this mosaic because i don't know what he's talking about hmm. and one that big one the farthest out has missed the thing completely if this was carved around the third blight, that gets you three heads. Doesn't matter. Those are all shallow details, probably followed by, and it speaks to me because my soul something regrets whatever. Now, the first thing those spits don't understand is that carving isn't just what you see. They've never made a physical thing and don't know the how of it. Depth is all tr tricks of shadow and such. The actual cuts are only as deep as the sculptor wants. And if you take a flat edge to this thing, what she wanted is strange because what I'm thinking is that this is one archdemon and the three heads are the reaction to the three lines. Because piercing a line one is on the same tier as a Tevinter second from left and the middle head turned away. Piercing line two is the head turned away and the line that misses, that's the same tier as the big Tevinter farthest out. And the dragon is looking straight at him. So the one, so the ones who did damage, the dragon doesn't care. The one who faked it, the dragon gives him an eyeful. I studied art for for like five years. It's twelve if you count high school. Jeez, ten years. So, ye, so much bull crap. <laughs> Anyways, now add to that. Artists like to hit big targets, but this carving has no faces. If she wanted to carve specific people, they'd be there. She has that skill. So what if she's not after the magisters? She's carved to venture herself. You've got four ages of the empire where they're part of the dragon. Two where they damage it and one where they miss the point entirely and it gets them eaten. Think about it too much and I bet you could come up with five different ways. Match their calendar including your favorite aunt's birthday. It's true. That's how I got into symbolism. <laughs> seriously, seriously. Actually, our, our art problem, I've obviously started it. But like, I mean, what's, I mean, folklore stored, started it in my childhood. And then uh, it taught me English, essentially. I, I read, I, anyways. And then the that led into 
uh, yeah, in school, it was English and fine art my entire for high school i started tabletop gaming during that time started settings that ravenloft in particular which was gothic horror influence and planescape which is uh, was a very tied to philosophies and religions and faiths and stuff like that um and the idea of like just the, the idea of like how thought is important to to things uh and then that led me to university which is i took i was taking three majors fine art english and philosophy <laughs> because I was captivated by the idea of things, man. I, don't, I can't explain it. And so, yes, this is true. So Renaissance in particular, uh, old Christian art, like where they had to hide messages and stuff, um, that was all through. Like there was, there are things like hidden in, in art, like little symbols here that would only be known by nobles and uh, or Christians. And it's, uh, it's, it was, it's fascinating stuff, but it's a lot of bullshit as well. <laughs> like, would people actually start getting pretentious about shit which i can lapse into because i actually it's almost like because i'm aware of how pretentious things can be i sort of embrace the fact that things could sound pretentious by embracing the pretentiousness <laughs> like simple symbolism is pretentious i'm sorry i can't i i love it though so i what, what am i gonna do <laughs> it's got a place I, I do believe in subconscious, like uh, oral tradition. Anyway, okay, okay, okay. I'm going to derail again. Empre uh, de Leon, the ancient name of these craggy highlands, has long been lost to me when the first Valmont emperor was crowned in the exalted age. The mountains were renamed in Pre de Leon to honor the house of Valmont, which bears a lion upon its crest. Wandering through these remote hills, I discovered. Remnants of a forgotten past mingled delightfully with signs of the present. Charming villages dotted the landscape and scattered among them relics of lost elven nation. Hmm. Young women sold wild berries at a market nestled in the shadow of a sinister crumbling fortress, which may once have been the seat of a Dalish lord. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Children played in fields, watched over by the silent statues of gods whose names they did not know i walked quiet lanes bordered with wildflowers the high arches of an ancient bridge soaring above me majestic even in their ruin sadly my time in the mountains was short and i soon continued to on to halam Sharal. i found myself thinking back on the empire de leon however and how gracefully she bore the passing of the ages i wondered what the future held and dreamed of how it might leave its mark Whatever came, whatever comes, can only add to her beauty. Delicate lines on the face of a gentlewoman, which speak of a life well lived. Brother Janet TV, resources found here, and that's probably it right there. It's filling up pretty good too. I like that. It's always a sign of how far like you're getting into the game. I. Uh, what did I, what else did I want to do? I don't care to be honest. I want to I don't know where am I at. Okay, that's enough. That's enough of that. Let's get to the world map. Uh did, did, did not the frost bag. I'm, I'm uh exalt the plains. One of Solus's old friends, a spirit has um has been summoned against its will and needs his help. Oh no, this was a spirit of wisdom. I immediately went to God, what is what the hell is its name? Israel. I'm gonna say Israel. Okay. The demon in Mass Empire. I was like, oh you know no no no, this was like a good spirit. Um Emerald Graves here before the dawn, much like the Inquisition. I I, I do forget which one it is I'm supposed to be at. It's the Exalted Plains. Alright, let's go to the Exalted Plains. Oh, it actually showed. Oh no, okay, okay, okay. Oh, Vivienne wishes to undo the damage done to her beloved circle of magic. Oh, okay. So we'll take us. Oh, two mages. Three. It'd be three mages. Mm, let me know how I feel about that. Because I'm always going to run into something that I can't break through or unlock after. Shit, though. Recovering phylacteries and tomes. Lost. Damn it. So I'm going to need. I'm, I'm taking solace. You're out of your mind. No, no I'm, I'm, ta I'm taking solace. I'm taking solace. The whole time. Solace. Uh, what else do we have? Holding the exalted planes. Yeah, the camps. Oh, all the mages are here. Okay, yay, it's a party. Okay. Yeah. And the rifts. Undead ramp. Undead ramparts to the west. Oh, 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 oh,
So, Blackwall, you're going to take a back seat, I think. All right, well, I'm going to have to toggle through. Let's go. I'm going to have to toggle through the mages. Oh, no, no, no. How am I going to do this? For real, though. How am I going to do this? Oh, this is going to be a hard map to choose. Now I'm actually trying to... Uh, uh, maybe an elf. Maybe Sarah. Hmm. Sure. Sure. Let's go. Here we go. Uh, I, I always... What is it? I just got to do it. Yourself, I got to do it. We... Bloodstone survey, and I'm good to go. Of course I am, because I rock. Um, I'm going... What a god. So just, there we go. Okay, let's take a quick look though. Just to see. Viridian and Bloodstone. Alright, well, we know we can do this now, so let's let's get get at it later. Venatory tone. Oh wait, we can probably finish this one just for the hell of it. Oh man, still need those things. Okay, let's get to it. Um I should probably pick something too, so well we have landmarks, so you know what? Let's just hit the landmarks and we'll work it we'll work it from there. It just gives me something to aim towards here. Oh, Desolus was one of my... It was weird because it was such a kind of a, a boring landscape in World of Warcraft, but I enjoyed it. It's called Desolus, right? I'm feeling so. The gray one with all the broken stuff. All the burnt down. No, it's the burnt something around. Anyways, Guardians of the Path. The plaque on the statue reads, Let the eternal flame purify your soul. Oh, damn. So then things like this, man. I didn't even see this was a person, man. <laughs> so what? <laughs> All right. So we've done that one. Oh. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What are we... Stop, 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 stop. I have to spot them first, I suppose. What are we dealing with here? We are dealing with... Oh, Freeman? Who cares? Yeah, let's just get them now. Screw it. You're dead. Uh, and we will... We're going the opposite way that I intended. So let's just kill these, and then we'll move back. Sandra will take care of Keep off the ramparts. I wonder why. Huh. Huh. Oh, these things are going to be everywhere, huh? Oh. Oh. Oh, 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 there's rash vine. I'm going the wrong way. Ooh, nice. Oh. Oh, this stuff is actually on fire, though, right now. Oh. Awkward. Alright. Take this. The Inquisition have arrived. They will take the Dales and say it is the Herald of Andrassi's right. There is no such right. These lands should be ours. Uh, yours. We cannot allow the Inquisition to gain a foothold. As our lays true defenders, you know what to do. Gordian. All right. Memorials of the Second Exalted March, the Path of Flame. Remember where Andrassi's champions first set foot in the Exalted Plains, called Dirtha Varen by the Elves. Alam Shural's dark heart was conquered, but one last challenge came from the elves, who would not submit to the maker. They gathered upon the plains. Our champions answered their call, marching in Andrasse's light on the path of flame. Lord Demetrius, uh, Aaron, Sister Amity, and Sir Brandis of Lac Celestine called the Silver Helm. Uh, Arcane Knights, weren't they? That came and, um, yeah. Alright. This one. Let the light of Andraste and lift your spirits. There's a lot of them here, though. Alright, so that's... Was there, was there another one? No. Okay, so from here, Favors of the First Enchanter. Oh, we can, we can sort of know. Alright, fine. Let's do it this way. Rifts of the... I'm going to go for some rifts, I think. Corporal Roslyn reports undead holding the western ramparts. Well, I think I think Vivienne is first. <laughs> Solace is right there. Um, you know what? We're right here. I'm going to switch it out now. 
Let's do the Vivian one so that I don't have to deal with that one anymore. So you, uh, you, and you. Confirm. Let's go get him. Also, what's this metal here? The Vir Virminite? No, Obsidian. Let's go up yonder. I know it's probably going to be off the path, huh? A lot of hit, a lot of rock wall there, rock wall there. Oh, we got a respawn. What the hell? Could have just let them fight. But of course. Oh. Oh. The veil is weak here, folks. Usually I go left, but we're gonna go right. Mm, all right, we might, we might have a way through here. That looks important over there, though. Ooh. Interesting landscaping. Oh my gosh. I mean, it's been dead for a while. There's nothing to be really creeped out about, you know? All right? Ooh! Look at that vista. Dang it! Oh, oh, oh! There is one up there. How do we get up there? We need to get that. Right here. Loot. Uh, what's up? Everyone relax for a sec, man. Do me a favor. Everyone just relax for a sec. Okay. Whoa, cool. What the hell? Let them go. Let them go do their thing. Let them go do their thing. While we uh, loot the place. If they keep running away. Nope, traps. That didn't work. Okay, good. Uh, you there. Freeman soldier. Are the other ones going to come? Damn it, they are. Alright. Change the plan. Come with me, Sarah. There we go. And done. Been freaking out for a bit so Cassandra can catch up. Oh, tons of hell over there. So cool. I think they're dead. It's only, it's only they're dead. Okay, that's done. There we go. Freeman messages. Jocelyn. Jocelyn. I don't trust that Gordian. Shoot, I haven't leveled her too in a while. What? I thought I had leveled everybody. I don't trust that Gordian fellow. He talks as though he's Orlesian, but I know he's not. I can hear it in his speech. Tell me you hear it too. I wonder what he's doing on that rise. He's forbidden us from going there, but I might take a look in a couple nights. Let me know if you want in. Have you heard anything from the Emerald Grave? They say Duhim's gone there to lead the freemen. Damn, I miss him. He was a good commander, a bastard, a fair. Gus. That was really annoying, that sound. I needed to move. Uh, get some velvet? Do? Oh, you're not an actual dude. Right here? Hey, Vivian. Vivian, tell me that was important that you came along for this. No? Hmm. Vivian? No? Okay. Glad I brought you along, Vivian. Glad I brought you along. Oh, I just signed approval. But she didn't say anything, so it didn't matter. Probably could have just taken it to her. What the fuck? Not this again. Ah, I got you the other. Hi, Hala. Okay, stop spinning around like a maniac, man. 
I'm going to stick to the cliff before go. Oh wow, that's cool. I'm getting up there, and then we'll uh, real, and then we'll look around. Right now, I'm more. I'm trying to optimize here because of the way these things work. I suspect this isn't gonna let me. Oh, yeah, good stuff. <laughs> okay, sh just relax. Everything's fine. Oh, hi. Oh, if they can get up here, then we can get up here. Yeah, we're fine. All right, because now we can get shards along the way. That way, if I don't want to complete the entire map, I don't have to. I can just go back to the oasis and do what I actually want to do, which is get the fire. Oh, yeah, I just want to know what like one of those things does all the way. I want to go through all the way. Just in case it matters. Could you imagine there's something up on the top of that thing? That was uh I'm actually getting dizzy. I'm really sick. Oh, I'm gonna puke. I'm feeling so I'm not feeling 100 percent today. Be doing this kind of shenaniganery. Come on, man! Oh my god, are you for real right now? I've scanned this thing three times. There it is. Oh my god. Literally, literally, literally right in front of me. Oh my god, that was annoying. That was so annoying. Okay, I don't know if I want Viviana anymore if I don't need her. I would rather bring Solace out. Corporal Rosalyn. Uh, I can afford to do the run back. Benatori, we can finish that one. You know what, I'm going to... Yeah, let's go all the way up. I gotta grab this thing anyways. Okay, let's let's go back here. Dorian. And we're gonna do a I guess we're gonna try to get these along the way, but we'll work towards the other campground. Oh hey. Read. Torn shit. <laughs> Dear sir, enclosed is payment for the last shipment. The Lord greatly enjoyed the fish prepared exactly as you recommended. How do you do it? Please keep them coming. He has a hankering for trout this week. Hurry up. What is that noise, man? Is someone hungry? Your stomach's growling. Cassandra, oops. Cassandra, are you raised? Did I see something wrong there? Yeah, yeah, I saw. you're fine. All right, moving on. I guess we're just randomly running through and, and, and going. Well, I guess I can cut through there. I, but you know what? Now I'm here. Lots of fighting for stupid reasons. That's awesome over there. But you know what? No, that, this is what I need a solace for. So what's wrong with me? No, 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 no! Don't do this! Don't do this! Don't do this! I don't want to go in, in that direction without solace. So let's go this way. Let's get that campground. Didn't I say I'd bring you back when I got there? I meant it. Be stupid. Like, please, please don't be stupid. Please don't be stupid. Don't be stupid. That was pretty stupid. It was doable, but that was stupid. I don't know, maybe there was a better way to get there. It was stupid. Wait, how did I... What are you talking about? What do you mean? How was I... I of course I was here. How did you put crap up... Oh. Oh, I take it back. This is stupid. Oh my god, don't do it. Don't do what I think you don't do it. Don't do it. Oh my god, this is annoying. It's like you can't you can't do stuff like this. This is a horrible design, man. Like how do you get up there without it, this being some super strange scaling objective here it totally is look i i suspected it but i didn't want to believe it this is stupid oh my god because it's not it's not precise enough to be to pretend it's a platformer it's not a platformer look 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 it's literally pushing me off the edges but how else do you get up there you know what i mean if there's another way oh is it this thing it totally is oh my god it pushes you off though it's not it doesn't do what you what you think you're doing and there we go still stupid 
Still stupid. But there we go. I know you're trying to make it cool. I'm sure you're trying. You're like, you know, it'd be cool platforming in this game. No, it's not cool because you have a shitty platforming system, Bioware. All right. Let's go this way and see. Oh, that one's unique ish. I'm gonna take you out right here. Do, 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 do. Oh. Oh. Come on, Freeman. I'm just gonna come around this way so I can get you back. What? Get out of here. Did I. Are we attacking Hala? We are. Oh, that was not my fault. Oops, that totally was right there. Well, they kill really easy. So there's that. There's a rift over there, too. Thank you, Dorian. Appreciate it. Woo. Level 11, so this is going to be very quick. Maybe this map will be like a two episode or two. So, I'm for it. I'm all for it. I mean, majestic creatures and all, but I mean, the Inquisition needs new armor, you know what I'm saying? Uh, this looks like it might have something. Hold on. Oh, no. Hi, what now? I didn't clear my packs? What are you talking about? Take this right here. Last words. The scout's journal is bloodstained and soggy from the rains, but some entries can still be made out. Day 12. Relieved Corporal Colin. At the Bone Hill Scout Post, not entirely happy about this change. This area sees no battle. Day 14 was correct in earlier prediction. Have only seen deer and rabbits. Kill a hare for food, but keep stores high just in case. Day 17 saw strange shapes watering the hills at night. The enemy, they walked aimlessly with shambling gait. Best keep quiver close by. Well, not close enough, my friend, because it's... Oh, I thought it was on the floor next what the hell? Wait. Wait. Like. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're cuddling? How do I get out of the fight? I want out of the fight. You know what? In the interim, let's go this way and check out this pretty art. And maybe we'll knock ourselves out of a fight. There we go. Andrewel's messenger. Andrewel, you say? Long ago, when our people were strong and free, we roamed the world as could do uh, and could do as we pleased. But we were taught by Andrewel, mother of hares, to respect nature and all of the creator's creatures. Even though the earth was ours, we did not misuse it. They say the great leaders of the people would pray to Andrewel for guidance. Where shall we hunt? Where shall we raise our halla? Where shall we settle and build? Andrew Will would send her messenger, the owl, to show the people the way. And they would follow him to where the land was blessed. Always keep an eye out for the noble owl. You never know. Andrew Will might have a message for you. Got Gisharel. Keeper Gisharel. Relaferin. Am I pa What is happening right now? Are you permanently under attack on this board so that you can't manage your packs? You have to leave blue rings behind? Yeah? That's cool. Well, um, wow, that's still... It doesn't feel like it's a long way away, but you know it's got, like this is going to cause me... Oh, well, it's not that bad, actually. Okay, fine. Let's get this one, and then let's... I'm leaving stuff behind at this point. What can you do? Oh no. Oh, oh no. Don't put it up. No, no. Don't do that. No, you put it at the top. Is there a ladder? Tell me that. Whoops. Whoopsie daisy. Hey guys. Guys. Break it up. Break it up, guys. <laughs> so much chaos. Great. Ooh. Oh no. I hit the focus attack by accident. Ah. <gasps> I totally did. No, this is gonna take me forever to come back. It was three large. Oh no! Stop. 
literally a minute ago. Is it after I cast the thing or before? Yes. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. My bad. I think I might have slipped or something. In any case. No, thank you. That was a great autosave, though. What great timing of that autosave. Holy smokes. <laughs> literally a minute before I fucked up. <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry. You're on my side. Oh, fuck, I can't take loot. Hold on, am I? Oh, yeah, hey, hey, I'm not in a fight anymore. Excuse me. All right, I don't know. Probably just sort of about six things. Let's just get through this so I can, like, auto loot and move on. Uh, you guys. What's up? You guys? You guys? Okay. Just hanging out, huh? So, you guys, you guys know any way up there? Oh, yeah. Made it. Yeah. Oh. Ah, there you go, Somli. Just gotta be patient, Somli. God damn. Shut up. Got it. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. Still have enough. Okay, space. Dude, what's on this side? Before we fall down. My, oh, was that like a stepladder thing again? Oh, well, I guess I could do that rift. Yeah, why not? Oh shit, not that way, guys. And get him. Is that spindly bastard immune? Why is it not triggering the end? Oh well, because Andrew got him. Where's the spindly bastard? He's over there. You there? Come join. Here he comes. Oh, Cassandra. I thought he was coming for me, Cassandra. Sorry. I prepared that better. Come over here, Cassandra. Protect yourself. Here. I protect him. I protect him. I protect him. Get those guys. Here he comes. Ah, I didn't even pop it in my space. How about now? No, now you're dead. Uh... Wait, are they on that side? No. We're fine. Alright. Right here. Whoa! You scared me. Oh, what that? Cassandra, no? No? You don't want to just wrap this up? I'm hitting F. Hey Cassandra. Pop. Alright, that's one. Unlock the final door. Yeah, well, that's not for cold though. No, not for cold. Okay, grab this. Um, I didn't delete that many things. Well, how am I still taking things? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! What's this? Come on, you can do this. You can do this. What's in here? I like how they guided you with this uh, rash vine stuff. That was well done. Everyone okay? Sound like there's a landslide behind us. Take. Ooh, sketch of an Anavurus River. Okay. I don't know what that means, but okay. We'll find out. Tons of rash vine. Yep. All right, that takes us back to the fort thing in Majig. So we're off the track again. I'm gonna go for this shard before wrapping up. Let's go this way. Oh, hey, wolf. Bye, wolf. No, it looks like it's gonna kick something off. Let's see if we can get up there without going into that direction. I don't think we can though. Okay. Well, this might be... Ville Montevallan. Mm. Alright, well. Looks like we need to go in here to get up there, so... Oh, these are enemies? Okay, even better. If they're enemies. Hey, guys! Wait, 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 wait. 
Oh, he looks cool. But no thank you. And then you know what? You know these. <laughs> Ooh, I like that he could knock my ass down though. Liliana is ready to report it. Alright, you know what? Here, you need some of this right here. Burnination! <laughs> Dodge that, bitch! Should have. I should be doing this right now. I can help it. <laughs> Cassandra. Uh, you're a. Uh, there's a lot of dead dudes. I can't see what I'm up against. So hold on. Oh, Freeman. Oh, just another stack of Freeman. Mm, yeah. Okay. Oh, I thought they was gonna I thought he was gonna run into that. There we go. Right. Oh oh, he's still going? Oh, it's one of those guys. <laughs> the, the the invisible running fire thing. What? Come get me. Come get us. Cassandra, yes, I love that move when it works out. I love it. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh. Wait, what? Oh. Okay, not creepy. Oh. That was neat. What am I looking at? Oh, dude's over there. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We're going off the bat. Let's go back this way. Are these just cell? Oh, what the? Music is interesting. The way it happened. Oh, that's where they put the dead. Okay. Oh. Uh -huh. I'm coming to fuck you up. You know what I'm saying? It's just like, like the more you get, the more you you group together, the better the better it is for me to slay your asses. So it works for me. Oh, hey, oh shit! This one in the white. What is this? Gordian. No, Gordian. Oh, he's he's. We're gonna have a problem. I should hold on if I don't plan this right. I said we're gonna have a problem if we don't plan. Did I just hit this by accident? No, I didn't. We're fine. There we go. No, no, no. No, thank you, Dorian. <laughs> Alright, let's focus on Gordian. Oh, he's a mage Ah, <laughs> thank you for that awesome move. I'll back up a little bit now. Whoa, look at that. Look how that turned out. That's neat. Uh, let's just give her a little benefit there, right? Because uh, doesn't she get benefits if he's all... I don't... Yeah, let's see. What's up? Shock taunted weakened. Immunity frozen. Oh, just, who cares? Cold resistance. Oops, oops, oops. It all works out. You're dead. You're dead, Gordian. I hope uh, I have the right people for this quest because I don't know. Is there another quest? Because <laughs> I'm still chasing this guy down here. Hold on. There you go. Where, where is he? Did you kill him? Oh no, don't don't glitch. I'm screwing something up here. There we go. Panic. Now we're going nuts, so panic run into some flame traps. And wow, he's taking it like a champ, though, man. God damn. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, this is a hit point sponge. Holy. Belong to Corypheus, you say? 
Do you have something on you that... I think I did something out of order. <laughs> or I, something. Something. I just came for a sh What is this thing? <gasps> Whoa. Should I walk in there? Like... What in the hell? Oh! Elemental barriers. Can be destroyed with enough typing. There you go, that usually does it. Burn. Burn. Bodies piled in a pit. Undead rising. Someone intended this. There may be more of these pits. Oh. We'll have to find them. Ah. All right. Oh, this is fun. Oh, unless it becomes a pain in the ass to climb because this game really sucks at this. Oh my god, it sucks so much at this. Okay, shard. It looks cool. That's gonna, yeah. I was reaching, I had to have been reaching uh, at the end there, but none of this is really good. It doesn't really matter. And so from here, oh, right. I was still gonna make a run for this thing, huh? Oh, shit. Hold on. This is still the. Ah, the Minotaur. I should make a run for. Whoa. And this is how you just get through a map organically. There was a path through here, I believe. I still have to do the fort, man. But look like this. Oh, this is the fort. So it's on the other side of the fort. And this was like the the through the vegetation got me to there, and then it gets me to the Venatori, which is important to get that done and over with. Cassandra right there. So this one's more important than this one, to be honest. I mean, no, this one's close. Okay, let's just um, let's try. Take. Oh right, I can't do that. I can do that. Ooh, Chantry Brown. Okay, cool. I, I, I've been through this. I'm going to leave that behind. Fine. Can I jump through the window? <laughs> so wait, take. Legend of the Three Sisters, book three. As with the stop in the White Rose, the individual tales of the Three Sisters are often told on their own. Seldom is the saga repeated in its entirety. Indeed, one of the few items... Well, one of the few times an attempt to do so was as a play in the Grand Royal Theater that sharply criticized Divine Justinia's attempt at reform. The play was quickly banned after only three performances. A book titled The Three Brothers was later published in Minrathos, citing the exploits of three Tevinter brothers who find themselves lost in Val Royal and spend their time ridiculing Orlesian culture. Despite claims in Tevinter that it is the original, it's quite clear that the Three Sisters legend far predates it throughout the legend's various incarnations, the most commonly depicted adventures include the sisters are convinced to drink dwarven ale by a handsome nobleman with sinister intentions. Their reaction to the ale vary, but usually by the end of this tale, the sisters end up on a wild chase after the nobleman through the streets of Belmarsh Bel until, until he jumps into the river and drowns. That's got to be a reference to a movie. The sisters ask for help from a group of dwarven merchants who say they will do so only if the sisters solve a clever riddle. The nature of the riddle varies, but the dwarves always cheat the sisters in the end. Typically, the encounter ends with the sisters fleeing before they are sold into slavery, though sometimes the legend has them cl clubbing the lead dwarf to death with paddles until the other dwarves run off. They are drawn into the annual Satinalia parade usually in the climax of the story until the imperial army descends upon the reveler revelers and starts a chaotic chain reaction that results in the sisters either stowing aboard a pirate ship or wading through the elven alienage sewers it seems to change each age once their chaperone labette catches up with the girls they usually hang their heads in shame and return to the montpelliard manse to resume good and honest lives not Always, however, the most recent versions of the legends have the, sister, the sisters remain in Valreo to fight criminals while wearing black masks, though I honestly cannot tell where this comes from. 
My brain's not putting. I mean, there's got to be. It's got to be meta in that. There's no way they did that. You anymore. don't laugh like a Devinter. Did. How is a Devinter supposed to laugh exactly? Cruel and stupid, like. <laughs> oh no. You're not allowed to laugh like that until you get your Magister license. Knew it. Varric owes me a sovereign. <laughs> oh, gee. I don't think he's serious. But it's okay. Just play along. All right. We're aiming towards this. For good or for ill. We are... We probably can't even get out. It doesn't mean invisible wall because it's going to be a pain in my ass that way. Right? Mm -hmm. All right. Let's go the long way. Like chumps. Hey, Dorian. Hi. I'm just hanging out, floating on an invisible fucking I know loud. Stop it. Uh. I could probably jump down off that thing, but hold on. Because now that I'm in this labyrinthine nonsense here, I'll leave it behind. Oh, I'll kill you. It's a demon. That's strange. Is that like just a random, like a wandering demon? Also, uh, I know I ranted a lot at the beginning, but I should really wrap this up and possibly continue. In a new episode, I'm leaving a lot of stuff behind. I know, I know. I need to just get out of here so I can re like remove this stuff from my packs. This was foolish. What's in here? It's gotta be. So oh shit! Let's look around. Of course. Yay! Take. We have Alva Alvarado's bathtub boot screech. I would drink the hell out of that. If you can read this, you haven't drunk it. <laughs> uh, oh, no. Oh, yeah, it's stackables. Good, good. Good. Good, good. Oh. Oh, maybe I couldn't stack three things, but oh. Damn. Look at this. Like, does that not look that stupid? That, like, this is so dumb. Why are you having trouble climbing, Somli? Anyways, there's a skull. Like, sta these are stairs. They're made to be climbed. You know what I mean? <laughs> game. Game. Stop being foolish, game. We have uh, this letter found in the pocket of an undershirt of a dead soldier is nothing more than a heart drawn on paper, then rolled up and secured with an old ring. Oh, was that tying into that one? The first message we got? But wasn't it like one of the early anyways let's look for this one here oh thank god this one was a little faster to do we are missing one though and we have to go back oh there we go yay okay we have a lot more things now can i not I don't think so. I think I have to go the long way, man. I tried. Oh, no, 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 no. You know what? Dorian, come with me. We're going to take care of your quest, buddy. Oh, that's like, this base is like... Can I? No, they're not. They're not going to like, they're like, no, you will stab your ass. No, nope. we're free. I'm going to I don't know if I was supposed to do that, but I'm getting the hell out of there. Uh, we have uh, some spirits, which you know what? They're free to be. I just want one simple thing, and that's one less Venatori. Ooh, Lordy. We'll be back. We'll be back, spirits. We will remove you from this world, and you will rest back from whence you came. There we go. Just gonna do a beeline because I don't want to run this all over again. Yup, yup, yup. Ooh, what's that big ass thing over there? Oh, hey guys. Bye guys. Guys? <laughs> guys? Uh, this spellbinder. Dorian? Do do oh no! Guys! Oh, he is here. 
I'm like, what if it doesn't count? Please. Did it work? <gasps> yeah. <laughs> so excited. There we go. Hope you're happy, Dorian. One less mage to keep around. Everybody saw us now. What the hell? What? What the hell? I have a feeling we had... Was there a cave back here? No, we can get through here. Come on. Uh, yeah, 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 no, 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 the map looked like this is impossible. I'm gonna get myself into a jam. I sense it. I sense it. I shouldn't be here. Um, what are you talking about? How do I? <laughs> I mean, I don't remember this at all right here, though. Hmm. Right here. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Here we go. Oh, look at this. Nice. Nice setup there with the uh, crows too. What the? Fuck? Oh. Could send men to clear this out if you want. Oh. Oh, it's like the one map. Oh, that's neat. Oh no. <laughs> That's the only way to get into the. Oh, God. <clears throat> Alright, try to get to this one. Still, that's cool. We can go to the map and take care of that. Please be easy. Please be easy. Please be easy. Please be easy. Thank you. This actually wasn't that bad to get to. Woohoo! <laughs> Um, and we're discovering things along the way. I'm trying to avoid things. I'm... What's this thing? Neat. I don't know what you are. And do I have to kill you in order to get a, a, a thing on you? Oh, it's so cute. I need its codex right now. Oh, no. Okay. We got ourselves a campground. I have explored nothing around here. There's a lot to do. So set up camp. But I need to I need to get the hell out of here. Hey, maniac. Ooh, look at that. Holy shit. Nothing to report, sir. Neat. Okay. Uh we're gonna end this here. Because uh, I'm going to go back to Skyhold. We're going to move some table stuff along. I'm going to empty my packs. I'll bring you back when all the stuff is all, all cleaned up. And I'll bring you back to the war table. And then we're going to get here as soon as we can. Uh, to continue exploring this map for another episode or two. Uh, before going to the Winter Palace. I'll catch you in the next one. Don't forget to explore. Engage and inspire everybody. Peace.